When I first decided to run for office, one of my biggest motivations was working to create a Canada that young people saw themselves in. Because the 21st century belongs to this generation of young people and Canada's future success depends on theirs. As Prime Minister, I've never lost sight of that. Whether you're just finishing school, starting your career, or raising a family, you, as a young Canadian, are the heartbeat of our economy. You power our growth, and you deserve an economy that gives you a fair shot at success. But this moment we're all living in is throwing big challenges your way. How can you save up for a home when rent is eating up so much of your paycheck? How can you get ahead when the cost of groceries, utilities, and everything else takes a bigger and bigger bite out of your wallet? That's not right, and it's not fair. So we're going to roll up our sleeves and work like hell. And we're going to tell you about what we're doing to fix it over the next two weeks in Canada's 2024 budget. Fighting for fairer prices, investing in the programs and services that help you get ahead, creating new opportunities, new jobs, new businesses. And most of all, we're going to build more homes and apartments in this country at a rate faster than we've seen in generations. Homes and apartments that you can afford in communities where you want to live and work. This builds on all the progress we've made in so many areas, creating millions of jobs, $10 a day childcare, providing free prescription contraceptives and insulin, cutting the child poverty rate in half, making real progress on reconciliation, and fighting climate change and doing it in ways that are affordable and that are building opportunities across this country. The economy should be recognizing and rewarding the work of young Canadians, just as it did for your parents and grandparents. Speaking of which, for those of you who aren't Gen Z or Millennials, Xers like me and the generations that came before, I know you feel this in your bones. You want your kids and your grandkids to have every opportunity you had and more. You get this, and I know it drives everything you do. I'm no different. We can't let them down. That's what this budget is all about.